Welcome to Urban Info Center. Today's episode, we'll be talking about Puente Tresa. The San Gabriel Valley is one of the principal valleys of Southern California, and it lies generally to the east of the city of Los Angeles. The San Gabriel Valley is home to many gangs, including Lomas 13, Azusa 13, Little Hill 13, El Monte de Flores, and West Covina Neighborhood Crip. But one of the most notorious gangs in the SGV has to be Puente 13. Puente is a street gang in La Puente, California. It is rumored they were formed in 1953 as the Bridgetown Gentlemen or Old Town Puente. Then they dropped the Old Town, later adding the 13th, paying allegiance to the Mexican Mafia. This gang claims the entire city and is one of the largest gangs in the San Gabriel Valley. They have several hundred documented members and have been one of the most active gangs in its respected area. This gang has several cliques which are infamous for not getting along with each other. Some of the most active include Ballista Street, Duff Street, Dial Street, Hurley Street, Rama Street, Perth Street, East Side Puente, Little Happy Homes, and the Ten Planes. There is a Blackwood, but it seems they have gone independent as they have a bitter rivalry with Ballistas, Rama, and Perf Street. Puente rivals almost all surrounding gangs, including West Covina Thresa, Azusa Thresa, Townsmen Thresa, Little Hill Thresa, and West Covina Neighborhood Crips. But their main rivalry is with Bassett Grande. With several bodies on both sides, there doesn't seem to be beef with the Almonte Flores, though. Puente members are known to rock the Pittsburgh Pirates hat, as well as tattoos that read PX3, P13, or Bridgetown, along with their respected clique. In June 8, 2010, there was an indictment. The indictment named 17 defendants, 16 of whom are charged under the Racketeering Influence Corrupt Organization Act. Four of the defendants in the racketeering case were eligible for the death penalty because of their involvement in a 2006 murder of a rival gang member who was collecting taxes without authorization. The remaining 13 defendants faced either life without parole in federal prison or prison sentences up to 20 years if they were convicted of the charges in the indictment. Not sure how that played out. In April 19, 2011, there was an injunction thrown on Puente Thresse. A judge granted a preliminary injunction that restricts the activities of gang members 16 miles of the San Gabriel Valley. The injunction covers the communities of Avocado Heights, Bassett, South San Jose Hills, and Valinda. It prohibits gang rivals such as Puente and Bassett from associating with one another in public, possessing guns, narcotics, or graffiti within the injunction area. It also has prohibited members from wearing gang appeal, trespassing on properties, and loitering in public places. It also imposes a 10 p.m. to 5 a.m. curfew for known gang members. If you enjoyed the video, please like, subscribe, and make sure to hit that notification bell so you don't miss any further videos. Also, in the comments, let me know who you'd like me to focus on next. Thank you.